I am reacting to another video. Yes, I am. Before I do that, I need y'all to go follow me on TikTok. Let me show you what my page looks like. It's blissful underscore experiment. I have only 4,000 followers, but hey, I have 57,000 likes, okay? I'm not doing that bad. I have a few videos on here that reached 17,000 right there, 17 there, 17,000 there. 13,000 there, another 17,000. I guess 17 is my lucky number, y'all. Um, if you scroll down a little bit more, I got 23,000 there, 16,000 there. Okay, let me tell you, 13 right there, 22 right there. This video here is getting drunk at home, be like, okay, I got 288,000 views on that. So go check it out if you haven't already. Go follow me, go show me some support. I'm kind of funny, you know, so I'm kind of a little funny. I am my own creator, okay? I'm not just reacting. Not to say that reacting does not take work because let me tell you, as a reactor for many years, it takes a lot of work. This ain't easy. This takes up a lot of your time to film, react, to edit, to upload, to do thumbnails. It takes work. That's why we have laws to protect us for fair use. All right, now that I plugged myself, I am ready to react to a TikToker, okay? This TikToker, his name is, let's see, To a Pre. I think that's how you say it. His name is Asif Khan. I don't know if y'all know about him, but he's got 906,000 followers, 15 million likes. Okay, it's for good reason. Oh, he actually has a YouTube channel. Hold on. He's got plenty of fun videos. He sure does. He is known to be trolling in his videos. Like, I don't even consider them pranks necessarily. I think he just likes to fuck with people. He likes to pretend to be a little ditzy, you know, a little dumb and a little bit uneducated and just oblivious to what's going on around him. He obviously isn't that, you know, he's playing a character, but it's so funny how he fucks with people, especially law enforcement, especially Karens. In my algorithm, I have lots of videos of people who go and audit public places because I love when they check these officers and the staff because they don't know all their policies and they don't know all the, all the laws that they're supposed to know. It takes a lot of bravery to do that because you are risking getting arrested. Even though you know your rights and you can name each penal code, they still find a way to arrest you and violating your rights. Of course, you're gonna have to fight afterwards, but it sucks that you have to go to jail for it. Um, but this guy, he does it in a way which makes it so fucking funny. He knows what he can and cannot do, but he likes to play dumb to these Karens, and <laughs> it's just so funny to me. It's different, it's unique. So I'm ready to react to one of his videos. We're gonna react to his most recent video that was uploaded a few days ago, and it's called Fishing Plus Filming Equals Crime. <laughs> I'm going to ask you nicely. He doesn't have any right. I'm going to tell you one more time to turn the camera around. He's still standing here in front of me, a strange man. I want his camera confiscated. One of my favorite baits this time of year is a mullet. I really love mullets. Hey, how you doing, sir? What's going on? Oh, not much. How you doing, young man? Get this out of here. Aren't you a lawyer? You're not supposed to touch Get this out of here. Okay, I'm meeting with a client. You can't film it. I'm about to meet with one of my fishing clients. sorry? I'm about to meet with one of my fishing clients. I love it. I don't know if he sounds like this in real life. I haven't looked deep into his videos, but he is so funny, y'all. He's acting like he's from the South, you know, he's there for his little fishing buddies or whatever the hell he said. He's got his camera on a tripod. You can see the reflection on the door. It's facing towards the business and it's a law office from what it looks like. He's really fucking with them. A law office out of all places. But the funny thing is he is not only filming them, he's also filming himself in the corner so we can see both perspectives and this man already I'm guessing is an attorney comes out he's ready he's ready for an argument he's ready for a fight but what's so weird about it is that you're an attorney you know the laws where at least you're supposed to right so you know what he's doing is okay and it's legal but yet here you are trying to intimidate him oh my god let's go <laughs> No, I'm doing, I'm doing a fishing show. I'm just doing a fishing show. Get it out of here. No, I'm doing a fishing show. Well, one of my favorite. Y'all okay. catch anything around here? Uh-oh, we got a Karen. What's y'all favorite bait to use around here? Karen and Carl. You guys want to start a fishing show? <laughs> I'm just saying, guys, what's your favorite bait to use around here? Do you, you like using mullet or shit? Please take your camera off us now. 
Oh, it's not on you. I'm just doing fishing. Okay, move the thing away. Turn it the other way. Doesn't a Karen always look like that? Dirty blonde hair, sometimes super blonde, and a cell phone. If y'all want to be something for Halloween, be a Karen. All you have to do is put on a blonde wig and have a cell phone on your hand. Here they are thinking that speaking to him aggressively in a strong toned voice is gonna get him to listen. But this man is fucking with him. He just wants to fish. Let the man fish in the street. Cause I, it was Turn about the plane. I don't care. Turn it around. Well, I'm just doing a fishing show. I don't care what you're doing. I don't think you guys understand though. Yeah, I don't think you understand. You can understand. Turn your camera around. No, no, I'm just doing a fishing show. I'm gonna tell you one more time to turn your camera around. Oh, but uh, you want to start a fishing show? I want you to turn your camera away from my face now. Okay. Why, why do they point the finger? Do they understand that that can cause bodily harm? Do that to the wrong person and they will fuck you up. Stop pointing your finger. I'm just giving you Karen some advice, okay? I'm trying to save you from getting hurt. Turn it! But I'll just do a fishing show. Okay, fine, I'll turn it, I'll turn it, I'll turn it. <laughs> Get the police now. I'm calling them. Some yes. are taking our pictures and he will not leave. Please send police now. I don't feel comfortable. Please, officer, please send the police. I'm a woman, I don't feel comfortable. Not, he's still standing here in front of me, a strange man. That's what Karens do, especially when it's a woman and they use that as an excuse that there is a man who is twice as big as she is and she now feels unsafe. You see that street, it's completely empty. If you were nervous or scared, you can easily just walk away. But obviously that's not the case. They use this tactic to get the police there as quick as possible to try to get their way. Cause all this man wants to do is fish. He's doing a fishing show. Let the man do a damn fishing show. They ran out of fish at the pond. Let him come to the streets in front of the law office and do a fishing show. Why does that bother you so much? I don't know. Please. If you're with me on an island, I'll catch all the fish for you. You feel comfortable? While we wait for the police, you guys want to tell me about the species of fish around here? Did you want to start a fishing show? Can I tell you a little bit more about what I'm doing? Yeah, I'm getting B-roll. Should I wait here with you guys, or? I don't know how the process goes. This guy is trying to film inside my locker. <laughs> he says, do you want me to wait for, do you want me to wait with you guys? <laughs> This man's crazy. I want his camera confiscated. I want my picture on there. Also confiscated. <laughs> he doesn't have my permission to have me on there. When they're angry, they speak gibberish. But check this out. You see how demanding this white woman is? She's so privileged her whole life that she feels that she, is, that she has the authority to the streets, to the businesses, and to the civilians that live in it. She says she wants that camera. She wants la 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 la. Girl, nobody cares what you want. Nobody. Oh, yeah, yeah, come, come over here. Yeah. I'm supposed to feel safe. Okay, I'll go inside. Yeah, he's filming my client in my office. He's got no right to do that. Okay. It's for a fishing show, though. Larry didn't know anyone was even in there. I was talking to her earlier. I'm friends with her. Yeah. How you doing? Hi, I'm Alex Arnold. What's up, Mr. Martin? Nice to meet you. <laughs> this cop looks fucking confused. I don't know whose side he's gonna be on. I don't know, some of these officers don't know the law and they fuck up, but some actually do and understand the situation and they're more chill and laid back and don't escalate, as they shouldn't. But you know, some of these officers, they get a little power trip when they put on that badge. Hey, so now they, you're in there. Oh, no, I didn't go inside. Sorry, can I just get your name and everything? Uh, so, uh, I just kinda, I usually kinda keep it on me, so I just like to chill. Because I'm one of the most wanted fishermen in, in uh, uh, East Coast, so. Right when I say who I am, there's gonna be flocks of people coming here. Okay, you just have your ID then instead of saying it out loud? Oh, gee, even later. It, it's, like a, it's like a whole thing, it's, it gets complicated. You guys have to be <laughs> This cop, I think he's a rookie. No lie, because I think he thinks it's funny. The way he's talking, the, the, shit he's, this, the shit that's coming out of his mouth, I think he finds it humorous. And he looks young. So I think he's understanding the situation, but he's just gotta do his job. My building for his commercial purposes. Absolutely. Come on in. You mind if I join too? <laughs> you guys mind if I join too just so we can keep fighting? Is that cool if I join too? Damn. Uh, that officer held that door open for him, but that attorney was like, fuck no. Is I think I told you guys that already. Oh, hi, hi, good. Yeah. Um, you are gonna need your ID to. No, 
what you are. You're saying that you were tapping on the window? Not true. By the way, that is not true. When a cop asks you for identification and, and your name, you do not have to give it. Do not give it. Now they have to give their name and their badge number. But you? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Don't have to give it. Do you have any video of like before I was here? It's not the same. Yeah, I've been running the whole time. What kind of fishing show you got? Oh, uh, strictly fishing with fishing on. Strictly, strictly fishing? Strictly fishing with fishing on. <laughs> <laughs> you already know. Alright. Should I should I come in there with you, huh? Just so no, no, I, okay. I don't think you want you in here. So. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. I uh, just making sure. I thought maybe you guys switched up. Let me go inside this time. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> They're Should laughing, yo. Much love, guys. What are we doing? That's awesome. Uh, you and I? Huh? Oh, uh, I didn't know we were together. No. Oh, uh, here we go. Here we go. I think he's at a different location now. Here we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm just doing my fishing show out here. Oh. In here? Oh, no. Out here. Can we do it somewhere else? <laughs> uh, like we? Is it you and I? Oh, it was looking like you guys were filming in here. Oh wait, now who got you guys is me and you? You. Oh, I, I saw see. the camera waving. You. I just asked what you were doing. Oh, it was waving in there. You. Wait, I was waving in there. With the camera. <laughs> Yo, this conversation is going in circles, but I find it so funny that he can keep going with it. He can do this shit for hours, and this woman is getting frustrated. Was in there waving with the camera? All right, have a good day, young lady. You All right. Can you move down a little more, then? All right, the dang perfect line. How you? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> What's it? Can help you? Oh no, thank you. I appreciate that. Say again. Oh no, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, we're not allowed to do this because we have. Their okay, so this is another business. Here we go. Don't take, don't don't film me. I'm not giving you permission to film me. Okay. Another fun fact, um, if you're in a public area, filmmakers do not need consent. That goes for anybody. If you are in a public area, I can film you. I don't need to ask you. It's a, it's a fishing show. You can be featured on the best fishing show in New Jersey. Um, no, I don't want to be honest, but they have to sign a waiver. Okay. In order for you to take pictures of them, I would have to say sign a waiver or you can get sued. Oh, right, perfect. I'll be waiting on the waiver then. Okay, so please I'll be don't take, on the please don't take nope. pictures of the dog. You're that also, even if it's a private business, if you're outside on the sidewalk and they are in plain sight, you could film them. So she doesn't know the law. You're not allowed to. Okay, you can tell the dog he can sign away. You're not allowed to sign. That's why this video is posted and that's why it's got 200 and some thousand views and has not been put down, has not been sued. It's because he can legally do so. You're not allowed to do that. I don't want to call the police on you. Please. No, no, no. We, we can say please. Please, let's go. Just move it along. Please, oh, I, because I got that's the owner in there and he's very upset. So please. Oh, I said he's not a dog person. No, he is a dog person, but you're not allowed to film somebody's animals. I, I need the wiper. You're not allowed to film me either. So if you film me and approach me, I will sue you. Oh, that sounds chill. Yeah, you got a body camera. Oh no, it's the same place. This bitch came out and she's like, this is the man from the fishing show. <laughs> I mean, uh, oh. oh, I see. Why are we recording that? Now by we, you mean me? You, you, you keep bending over in some our shop. I was like, bending over inside the shop? You as well. Okay, can you stop recording me, please? Can you back up, please? Can, please? can you stop recording me, please? You're not allowed to do this. I'm gonna call the police. You're gonna say please? Alright. It's as simple as this. If you do not want to be filmed, all you have to do is go inside, close the blinds. That's all. But you guys are making it so difficult for yourselves, getting upset, all in your emotions for no reason. Can you call the cops? Because he's chill. He's chill. You guys wanna start a fishing show? <laughs> You guys can start a fishing show. Look, what happened? I thought he can't film you guys without consent. What are you doing, man? Why are you feeling that? Why are you filming this guy? What's wrong with you? I guess I guess the rules don't apply to everybody, huh? You got this picture. Cops are getting close, so it's okay. You. you need a waiver, otherwise I'm gonna see you. <laughs> That's what that lady said. I know. Sounds ridiculous, huh? 
Hey, the reverse psychology on you. He said it on you, he said it to you, and you thought that shit was funny. Ooh. Who do you work for? Oh, no one. Nope. You're not allowed to do this. I don't know what you're doing. Are you just blocking the dogs? Excuse me, sir. Are you putting your right next to my phone? I'm gonna answer you. Hey, 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 hey. Let go. Let go of the equipment. You are not allowed to touch someone's personal belongings. To move the thing. Well, it's gonna be nice, otherwise you might get a more time, Nick. All right. Because the next thing I do is pick the fucking <laughs> phone and throw it. Where are you from, redneck? Damn. Oh. If he really was a redneck, that's offensive. <laughs> Remember, I can do a double leg from here, so don't try nothing slick. I'm just filling this cute dog get by, by some dude with a weed wiper in his hand. Yes, we have a uh, intruder at um, on Broad Street. Uh, at the so if anyone is afraid, this redneck should be. That guy's got a whole weapon that he can use against him. Anyways, it says, then they started frantically stacking random objects that kept falling on the cages, all with a super edge edge energy while yelling through the glass and starting the dogs and startling the dogs. You see what I'm talking about? Y'all motherfuckers are crazy. You guys were afraid of this man filming the dog and you're, you're making it more chaotic for these dogs, poor babies. See that shit, Gizmo? I would never let that shit happen to you. Smile for the camera. Okay, you too. Oh yeah. We can both smile for each other's pictures. Come look, I got a cool angle. Come over here. You gonna stand there being stoic? Or you gonna come over here and get in front of me? That's my better angle. You got it? Yeah, hold on. The lighting in the background is a little bit overexposed. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Uh uh. Ah, ah. Hey, do dog grooming in there? Trying to scare this man. You ever do dog grooming? I used to have a little shih tzu. She get them dingle bears on her fur. Oh, he has a shih tzu. Gizmo, you're not the only one, baby. You're the cutest one, but you're not the only one, baby boy. My dog's a shih tzu. Clean it out, damn right. You will hear all my dog stories by the time they please show up. <laughs> Hold on, you guys. Oh, sorry, Gizmo. Gizmo saw that I'm reacting to some dogs and he wants to know what's going on. All right, baby, let's watch. I don't like to take any pictures of anything that goes on inside our shop, unless he's, unless he's been entering the shop and he hasn't. So he just wants to scaring customers away, putting a camera by the window, and he has no right to do that. It is, officer. Um, some of these cops get really annoyed because they know they can't do shit about this situation. So it's a waste of their time. It's like, I have other things to take care of. Why the fuck are we here? Because Karen and Carl just want to start some shit. I mean, he could film in public. See? Well, he's putting his camera up to the window and watching everything from the inside. So also the video blinds closed. We've had to close the blinds. And we have, we have those that are scared. He's coming up to the window. Uh, he's sick. The guy is sick. He's been trying to video it. No, we don't know who he is. I have pictures of him, so he better never come back again. This guy's sick. <laughs> What's going on? The cop is funny. Did you see that little smirk he did? Right, I'm gonna have to rewind it. Look. Look at this. Once this guy said he's sick. Look at the cop's the face. Uh, he's sick. The guy is sick. He's been trying to videotape. No, we don't know who he is. I have pictures of him, so he better never come back again. But this guy's he's sick. What's going on? <laughs> Rolled his eyes and everything because he knows that this fisherman, redneck, has not violated any laws. That's how you do. Alright. What, uh, is there any reason? Are you filming inside the building? Oh, just about still here. Huh? Just a bunch of stuff from my fishing show. I can't hear you. Just a bunch of stuff from my fishing show. 
Okay. We have no fish inside, you know that, right? You got uh, other animals though. Right, but that, that's not your right to take pictures then. Why don't you go to your fit to your fishing hole down the street and get away from our building? I couldn't catch no fish. I might, I might as well lean back on the dogs well, it's now. it's probably your terrible personality attitude, so why don't you leave? I ain't got nothing to do. It's a tide. It's low tide out there. That's why I didn't catch anything. The fish know I have a lovely personality. So. I told you they ran out of fish at the pond. Uh, I'm just confused. What are, you, what are you trying to get from us? What am I trying to get? Yeah. Cute doggy got my attention. Also didn't care to answer the completely irrelevant question neither of us cared about. Right. The cop didn't give a fuck. I mean, you can film in public. I just don't understand why you're... Do you have a right to film this? Yeah, I mean, I mean, if he's bothering customers coming in and out, though, he could be arrested for uh, disorderly conduct, blocking the sidewalk, stuff like that. But I, I don't really know he could film in public. Know your laws, ladies and gentlemen. Know your laws. Is there a reason you're bothering this gentleman? Oh, I wasn't bothering him. Yeah. I mean, obviously, you're bothering him. No, no, I'm not. He came out to get bothered, dude. And that's a fact. He's filming his business, so. Eh? Yeah, it's chill. <laughs> yes, yeah, chill. For a reason? Oh, no, it's for my fishing show. That's all. What's that to do with fishing? Well, I, I just got done fishing. No, hey, now we all laugh. Now we're all friends here. And you don't have to. And you don't have to answer questions by the officers as well. If you're not being detained, you do not have to answer no questions. Yeah, we're good, right? No, we're pay, we're pay the get lost. Come on, now we're all friends. No, we're not. I saw that smile. No, because it's you're insane. That's why. That's why I'm laughing. <laughs> There's no business being here. All right, it'll be insane, insane. Why don't you get a job or something, bro? I don't, I don't want to have to have, I'm going to have a manager like you coming out of micromanaging and come please on me for you. I think I did, but it's, unfortunately they can't bring you out yet. Exactly. Like I said, I mean, he can film, you know, he can film in public, that's not an issue. Uh, if he comes inside the building, he's or he's, if, here's the thing, if he's, if he's blocking people from leaving your establishment. We can't even, we can't even work here. We have to jam things up against the window. He's got his camera up against the window. Yeah. Close your blinds. They don't close all the way, no. Well, oh, that's on you. Close the way down. So, what did you have anything you could put like in the window? No, we don't have anything. We don't. We usually don't have crazy yeah, people. Like Listen, all this time that you're spending talking to this officer and fucking with this redneck, you could have gone to Home Depot, to Lowe's, and gotten yourself some blinds. Even Walmart. Fuck it. Target. Fuck it. Go get some blinds. No. We should, How long has this been going on? Today. <laughs> I don't know if today. today. I think it was just today. But I, I don't know why you just want to leave. I, I, I mean, I don't know. The bar's open. You know, if you want to go to the bar. You want to come with me and we get a, we get an old fashioned together? Yeah, yeah, I'll meet you there. Well, how about we walk together? No, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't care. Come on, man. He just wants to be friends. He's trying to catch a friend, not no more fish. Come with me, you know. Non-verbally communicating. Hey, Sergeant, I'm chill. I'm just trolling Karens. Don't need into it. Don't feed into it. Just walk away when the monkeys are distracted again. Primates can only focus on one thing at a time. So when they start talking again, just go. I mean, he can build in public. The issue is that, I don't know, like, you know, monkeys not blocking the entrances. Or Our problem is your customer is putting funny. his camera up to the window and videotaping what we're doing inside. That's not, that's not, I mean, that's not for him to do. I don't know what we're gonna do. <laughs> we can't even block the windows. That's fine. You guys, I'm not gonna pause at every you know text that he puts on his video. If you, if I didn't say anything out loud, just pause my video and read it. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Oh, I thought you were talking to me for a second. I thought we started fresh. No, I was talking to a human being. I'm a human being too. Unless I catch so many fish, you thought it was a fish because I smell like fish. Um. Well, like I said. You know, if he's blocking public access to, to the sidewalk, to, to your establishment. I mean, we have better things to do than babysit this clown up here, you know what I mean? Yeah, I wish I had better, uh, better advice. I mean, if you could get some, some blackout, blackout, blackout lines or something. We've never had to do, we never had to do this because we never had somebody, you know, I don't know what, I don't know. We're preparing for the world turning crazy. We're all in preparation together. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the train horn echoes throughout the neighborhood in agreement, foreshadowing. We are in this, in this together. Like I said, from a 
This is kind of annoying though when, when this police officer and Carl only talk amongst each other while he's standing right there, completely uh, ignoring this man. No. As if he doesn't exist. You know, it's, it's unfortunate. And this is typically how they treat the homeless. And he's a redneck, so I guess one in the same. <laughs> he's not illegal. Well, I can't stop. Okay, it's not fortunate that he's able to film. I wish it was illegal too. You're not allowed to film people or unless, unless you have their authority. I thought that too. I'm learning, to, I'm learning right now too. I'm learning with you. You could uh, film in public. I mean, we've always had the, the couple of people that walk around here, the usuals. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, not, not usually somebody that doesn't want to leave. I'm an unusual usual. Yeah, he's playing just, he's just a nuisance out here. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, like I said, just don't engage me. Right. You know, there is an issue with people getting inside. Or something. Yeah, somebody complains to us. Right. Be different, not be different. Should we end with a bet? And on a positive note. This motherfucker. This motherfucker. Ooh, I cannot stand people like him. I cannot stand them. Did you see what he just did? He literally, this, was, this is no longer intimidation. This is him threatening physically. This man literally put that weapon around him and even went up in the air, down in the air. And if you see the officer, he did turn back a little bit, but I think he must have missed it. But let's rewind that because I want to see that shit again. That's crazy. That's crazy. Every time I was about to leave, they kept flicking me off through the glass. So I stayed for over an hour to train them. Kind of like dogs or whatever. <laughs> ah! Hey, sometimes it's gonna teach these motherfuckers a lesson. Oh, are you finally going to Home Depot to get them blinds? Hmm. You never know what's in that channel. You just gotta be careful. You can catch sharks from the beach, honestly. You just toss them the same. Next thing you know, you got a big shark on the line. He's over there <laughs> pushing his bite. You got a female trying to impress. So he ostracizing the monkey. Might hype himself up, make him seem like normal, make him seem like the alpha male. That, uh, that's the uh, in charge round here. And the alpha male can mate with her later. <laughs> what the fuck? He's trying to have SEX with her. Yeah, it's turned from a fishing show to a monkey show. Uh, turned into a damn primate show. <laughs> I start talking about fishing, end up talking about monkeys. Just some little minnows for bite. It's an alpha yeah, thing. It's an ego. It's pride. We should come back another day. Yeah, we will. We have all corruption, cops, judges, anything was for sale. <laughs> Yo, if you have not already, please subscribe to this man. He is so funny. Again, his name is Tu Apri. Let me know if you want me to react more to his videos. I'm all down to react to couples, breakups, drama, all this shit on YouTube. But, I, I, but honestly, you guys, sometimes I just want to laugh. I just want to have a good time, okay? If you're down with that, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload, y'all. All right, gotta let y'all go. Peace!